Bryce Farmers on the quarantine and the SU Cable Coast would be smiling all the way to the bank. This is why. Sea Rice Caribbean Guyana, a local rice shipping company, has paid over $2 million in debt owed to the Guyana government. The Ministry of Agriculture had facilitated a loan to Myconi Rice Mill Limited, which was to pay for paddy from smaller rice farmers. The company's general manager, Douglas Chappelle, told the media today that the company had made arrangements to pay farmers for paddy owed by the now troubled Myconi Rice Mill Limited. By doing so, part of our investment will take the form of settling the, the outstanding creditors that uh, have been owed money for a long time at those mills. Uh, that entails paying back a loan that was made to those mills by the government uh, in 2011. That debt, which totaled 495 million Guyana dollars, was in fact settled eight days ago. That is now taken care of, so the mills are no longer indebted to the government. Chappell said this development was part of an agreement that was concluded between the Ministry of Agriculture, the Ghana Rice Development Board, and Sea Rice Caribbean Guyana Limited. With the new agreement, Sea Rice Caribbean Guyana will now have 50% of shares in the smaller rice mills. Very old debts for paddy purchased and not paid for to farmers in the Essequibo region and in the Blackbush Polder region of the quarantine and we intend starting tomorrow to settle the payments to those farmers too. That sort of basically concludes our investment in return for which we take over ownership of those mills and begin to operate those mills starting with this very crop that's commencing at this time. We hope that, uh, and in fact more than hope, we feel sure that we will be uh, a very good, honest, reliable alternative to the farmers. Chappells said the company is hoping to start operating the rice mills starting from the current crop. Leroy Adolphus, Capital News.